Hi, and welcome to the member portal of the Fulbright Association. We have improved and updated the portal to make it a little more social friendly. Um, when you log in, you'll see this page. It's the My Feed page. Um, this is where you can post uh, things just like any other social media platform, but it will be for members only. So if you wanted to post a, a new blog post that we saw, you saw on the awesome blog at Fulbright Association, you could do that. When you put in the um, link, it will automatically populate some information and then the link will be out there. Um, the next part is your profile page. So you can edit your profile page, your photo, um, your information, all your information here. Um, that's like Fulbright year, organization, address. Um, if you'd like to change some of this, you can always hit edit um, and it'll take you to your, um, all your information. And anything with a little lock means it's private and anything with a little member symbol means that other people can see that um, other members will be able to see you know your address or where you went to do your Fulbright um, makes it easier to connect with people so you can change any of those settings here um, a very cool feature as well um, within your um, profile is you can you can set uh, your preferences on you know what you want to hear about uh, when you want to get emails, if you want to get any emails at all. Um, and, and a really cool thing is that you can also connect your uh, Facebook or LinkedIn in order to sign in with that account. Instead of having to remember your Fulbright membership portal account, you can just easily just do it through Facebook or LinkedIn. Um, also under the profile tab, uh, you can have your, your invoices, your store payments, donations, etc. Um, your event registrations will be here if you have registered for an event. Um, and in order to access this, you can always do this up here um, under your name, account and settings or invoices. So the next really cool feature is the directory. You can find people within your state or chapter. There's the chapter list. Um, we'll just try and find some people in Alabama. So this will display all the current members in Alabama, including the institutional members like Auburn. Um, if you click map these results, you will get a map. Um, and if you zoom in to the map where Alabama is, you'll be able to see these little people icons, if you get close enough, that, um, and you can click on them and it says, oh, there's Auburn University there. Um, so if you click on that, you can see their profile, their information, some description, um, and you can also connect with them. So if you click connect, you can send a message and basically like a friend request or a connection request. Um, you can also met directly message them through this app portal. Um, the next thing is you can always check your own messages here on the messages tab. Um, and then once you have some a, a friend list or connections list, they'll also appear here. This is new for me, so I don't have any yet. Um, also, if you're part of a chapter, a group, then the groups will be displayed here. You can see um, the group members, that group page. Um, so you can see all the, the groups here. Um, so if you click on one, you know, it'll have their feed, some other news if they post that. Most chapters are posting on their own website, but they might post things here too. So here's the quick links. If you want to get to the Fulbright homepage, go to the online store, career center, et cetera. Um, so the majority, a lot of the pages will be here as far as your profile and connecting with people. Some of the pages may look differently if you go to um, the store or make a donation. Um, so if you, if you go to like the online store, for example, um, it won't look like the same as the, the header, but you can always uh, go back to my feed here to get back. So that'll take you back. We hope that you enjoy the new features for the membership portal and please let us know if you have any questions. The email is info at Fulbright.org. Thanks.